I'm back. Welcome back to my channel, The Struggle is Real with the Makeup Nurse. Today is Senate Saturday. So let's get go ahead and get started. We're going to start off with the Thayer's Lavender Toner, as always. When this is gone, I don't know what I'm going to do for Senate Saturdays till my next assignment. I oh, want well, one less product for you guys to see. Get it all clean. For this morning. All right, we're gonna go in with the Kiwi Icy Rum again. <laughs> just squirt it all over my hands. I think it's all right. And for serum, we're gonna go in with the normal Tony Moly watermelon one. smell that. I love scented Saturdays, especially when I can actually smell. Okay, for eye cream, I'm going to use the Coffee to Glow eye cream. This is what I was thinking of last week when I'm like, I think I had eye cream. I'm not really smelling the, I'm smelling the watermelon over the, I'm not really smelling this. Okay. Now for moisturizer, I'm going to use the e.l.f. Jelly Pop this time. This smells like watermelon. This almost feels like a serum, but it says it's moisturizer. Which, you know, before makeup, I guess it's not a bad thing to have it more lighter. Okay. For my lips, I'm going to use the pineapple balm again, just because it's right here and I always forget about this. Okay, we're going to use the CoverGirl Peach Palette. And it smells like peach. Imagine that, right? Okay, we're gonna go in with, let's just go in with this shade here for all over. Is the transition. Okay, and then let's go in with this brown shade at the end for right above and the actual transition on the crease.
I love how these brands are making scented, have made scented um, products because they're a lot cheaper than Too Faced or Tarte or whatever. And there's some, I've been looking on Amazon for at the Tarte or the uh, Too Faced stuff. <sighs> Man, it's so expensive. Okay, let's go in with this peach shade. It's kind of lighter, so we'll see. Okay, let's go in with this shade here for on top of the inner corner. Okay, wet my brush and I'm gonna Put a little more to pop it. And kind of outline that cut crease. And I do that so I make sure with my hooded, hooded eyes can kind of see it a little more and then for the middle in between shade I'm going to take this darker color put right there okay so the priming spray from I Heart Revolution Tasty Peach All right, let that dry down for a second. Okay, for primer, I'm gonna use the Marc Jacobs one. Um, this is supposed to be, it says Blur and Coconut. I thought I remembered it smelling like coconut, but I don't smell anything right now. interview that they rescheduled for, for next week they just told me that they made an offer with another candidate so that interview is canceled so now back to square one trying to find the next assignment oh well that's why I glad I was able to start ahead of time because and of course, I'm going to use the Do You infused with juicy watermelon and fresh cucumber from Too Faced because um, this these things happen, and I need to have a job right away. So I do smell it. I smell that. So I don't. I don't know if anybody has the Marc Jacobs um, primer. The coconut one, do you know if it actually smells? Because I thought it was supposed to smell like coconut. But I can't smell anything. Just when I thought my sniffer was getting better, now I feel like it's back again to like 50-50. It just comes and goes, I guess. Good days and bad days.
All right. Well, I don't have a concealer, so I will be back. Okay. For bronzer, this infused with peach and sweet fig cream from Too Faced. Try to put just a small amount because I always put way too much of the brunt, this. And then it makes everything else dark. Got a clump. I'm going to have to get more of this foundation before Too Faced uh, changes anything. Because I don't think there's any other scented foundations. If there is, please let me know. And I can get it and just keep it at home for now. So I can't bring anything back here and I don't need it. I have plenty to last me the rest of this dent. Okay. So last week I used this NYX Butter Gloss for lip gloss. I'm going to use it for blush. And this is the Angel Food Cake shade. And I did like it as a blush, or a lipstick. I like this color. So I'm going to see what, what it does. And this color for blush. I do smell that. I might have to put another coat on it. <sighs> I just hope I can find something closer to home because that interview next week was a Georgia facility, three hours from my house where I'm at. That would have been perfect. I could have went home every weekend if I wanted to because it's a short drive <sighs> oh well life is life right okay last week we went in with Morphe so this week we're going in with Elf Jelly Pop and I do kind of smell that watermelon scent Blend that in. Okay, now we're gonna go in with the Cody Airspun powder, and this smells like a perfume. And look at how much you get, and it's like a drugstore. Um, I got this one off of Amazon, but you can buy it at Walmart or Target. I've seen it there. And so, And it's not that expensive. I can't remember how much it is. But I, if I had to guess, no more than 10 bucks, and you get like this whole thing. It will last you a long time.
for the my T zone, I'm gonna do the cream shot, and this is supposed to smell like some sweet. I don't know if it's birthday cake or what. I kind of smell it today. But my, like I said, my scent today is just not having it. I just put a whole bunch under my eyes. That's okay. It's kind of like I'm baking today. I'll leave it on as I'm baking. Okay, so for bronzer, I'm going to use the position formula, the butter puff one. I don't really, I kind of smell it, but not really. And my scent, it must be really bad today. Okay, let's get our nose. Make our lip pout. Make a nose. Okay, let's blend all that in. This brush, let's take um, this brush, wipe away that powder. Okay, and then the Physician Formula is Butter Believe It Blush. I'm not smelling it. I did smell it that one time, but I'm not smelling it now. Then the Heart Candy um, Highlighter, and this is, I believe, supposed to smell like Pina Colada, which I can't smell it right now. Man, my, I'm like not doing good today. Let's do under our eyes. Let's do this peachy shade. Okay, let's finish our eyes. I'm going to go in with this shade again. And just kind of put it underneath. This eye. Then I'm going to go in with the highlight. 
highlighter and pop that out a little more. And maybe just put a little bit of a highlight right there. Okay, now for lipstick, I am going to use this Superstay Matte Ink from Maybelline. That, and Mixie B gave me this. She's like, oh, it smells like, I think, chocolate. And so she gave it to me. Oh, and I can't smell it. I think she said chocolate. And I can't, I can't remember if this was a matte or, well, it says matte, but I mean, like, really drying. Um, she did a video with it. I'm trying to remember the video. But she sat in it. While I'm trying to figure that out, let's do the pineapple setting spray from I Heart Revolution. I actually smelled a little bit of that pineapple. Yay! Smelled something. Okay. And then, while that's drying, let's um, do my hairspray with the, the Aussie. That's supposed to smell like grapes that I haven't been able to smell for ages. And yes, I have to use a lot because my hair is so darn curly. And I used the scented vanilla from um, Secret Deodorant. And of course, the pumpkin pecan waffles. I actually didn't get this. Um, my niece did when she was with me in Washington. And um, she left it, so it's mine now. Okay, it is getting really dry so I'm gonna use the fruity um, flavored lip gloss, lip gloss from Shop Masse I don't really smell anything but it says flavored so maybe it doesn't smell maybe it's just flavored I don't know Got some on my lip, on my tongue. It's not flavored. Yes, it's flavored gloss. It's not flavored. Okay, this is the final look for Sun and Saturday today. Let me know down below what you think. And the riddle of the day is, what did the triangle say to the circle? Let me know down below. See you next time.